Yo, what is going on everybody, Vuxu here, and I'm going to be doing my uh, 500 sub Q&A, as I said I would a few days ago, and uh, I put a video up on YouTube uh, to let you guys know to tweet at me some questions. I didn't get many, but I don't really care, I'm just going to do it, because uh, the last time I did this was like 9 months ago, so good time has passed, so I'm going to do another one, and uh, especially since I got 500 subs now, so thank you guys for that, and uh, so yeah, I'm going to get right into it. So the first question is, what is your favorite movie and song at the moment? Also, what are some of your hobbies? Uh, other than gaming so I don't really have many favorite movies or songs um, because I don't know they just change a lot I, I'd say movies like the most recent one I saw was Deadpool um, and that was really good that was actually a really really good movie um, I'm hoping I'm, I'm definitely I don't buy many DVDs for many movies but when that one comes out like the DVD for that I'm gonna buy it and uh, hopefully I'm gonna watch Batman vs Superman that, that'll be good too so that's my favorite movie at the moment uh, song, I don't really have a favorite song. I've been listening to a lot of like Kendrick Lamar at the moment, but I, don't, I wouldn't say I have a favorite song even as of now. But uh, yeah, that's really it. What are some of my favorite hobbies other than gaming? Well, gaming and YouTube are my hobbies. So, I mean, I wouldn't say I have other hobbies other than that because that's really what I do. Like if I'm not playing, which is gaming, I I'd just be like editing in general, like whether for some video or whatever the case may be. But I mean, I just watch a lot of TV shows. So yeah, that's really it i mean youtube and uh gaming are my hobbies but other than that i just watch tv i guess the next question is uh if you were stranded on an island with a serial killer and a hitman who would you kill so what i'm gonna guess here is that there's both a serial killer and a hitman on the island and i have to kill one of them and live with the other one like the one that i didn't kill um and i'd say i'd kill the serial killer because a uh, serial killer is more like somebody that just wants to kill for the shits and giggles and a hitman is like i mean they probably like killing too no shit because they're a hitman but they're doing it for like the money like it's a job but a serial killer if i spent a lot of time with a serial killer they'd probably just want to kill me but a hitman probably would not because it's not a job so i'd say I'd, my chances of staying alive longer would be with a hitman rather than a serial killer so I, i'd kill the serial killer um the next question why did you start youtube and thank gosh you did well, uh, thank you for that. Uh, why did I start it? Well, because it was one of those things where I, I mean, even before I started playing Call of Duty, I was watching YouTube videos on Call of Duty and I just thought it was fun to play and I just wanted to make videos because like I was starting to get Moabs and stuff and, and quote unquote clips and shit on Modern Warfare 3 and uh, what was happening is my vault, which is like the theater mode thing, like my clip section was getting too filled and so it's like I can't really show my friends you know what I got because I have to keep the leading stuff and I want to watch it myself so essentially it was just like I got a YouTube so I can watch my own stuff that's why I upload like every nuclear I get so that way I can watch it whenever I want and my friends like I can show my friends oh look at this cool thing I got or like whatever the case may be that's really it um even to this day I don't really I don't make YouTube videos for like for other people or to get big or whatever the fuck I just like for me for my own enjoyment and for my friends enjoyment that's really it uh the next question is do you remember your first console and uh yes I do for most people it was like the NES or something like that or the N64 mine was the, actually the PlayStation 1 I'm sure my brother had an NES when I was like already born but I don't remember it and I'm probably never played on it but I, d I did play the crap out of like the PlayStation 1 and from like the PlayStation 1 I never even went to the 2 I went to like the Wii for a really long time and then from there it was like to the Xbox like my first ever console was the PlayStation 1 and I played the crap out of that uh, the next question is if this dude slaps your girl's ass what you doing um, there's gonna be a picture of the dude on the screen so most people will probably confront him you know get mad I'd, uh, I'd probably just get a Twinkie and like throw it far away into the bushes and uh, see that fat kid run more than he's ever run before in his life and uh, go chase after that Twinkie because at the end of the day, we all know uh, that Twinkie is probably more important than any girl because he's a fat fuck. So that's really all I'd do. There you go. Um, so the next question, is there any specific person that got you into red gunning and do you have any inspirations? So... That's, I mean, I understand the question because technically I red gun feed, quote unquote, but the way that makes it sound is like, oh, I was a sniper the whole time and then I got into red gunning, which that's not the way it goes, right? Because red gunning is just using a normal gun. The weird thing in gaming is sniping. The weird thing is not using a regular gun. So that's why I always think it's funny when I get messages from people like, oh, you fucking red gunner. You mean 
you mean somebody that's not sniping and I'm, I'm a red gunner because I'm not sniping it's a it's a very weird thing and the funny thing is they only complain because I'm killing them if I was bad and was using a red gun I wouldn't be considered a red gunner I would just be a bad player so it's I always find that really weird that people think I'm red gunning but nothing really got me into it I mean I just played the the main thing I played was domination but I didn't really like it because playing solo domination was hard for me because in order to win like it was very easy to get spawn trapped by the enemy because I would play solo all the time and my teammates usually suck and this was around Mara for three times and uh, you know I, I, I would look for a different playlist that I could play in rather than domination and so I started playing drop zone it wasn't even for clips or anything I just liked like I still to this day I like drop zone as a playlist like I like the spawns of it and I like, um, I like that there's not constant UAVs up because they have to get it from the care packages. And so from there, from playing Drop Zone, I ended up getting some clips here and there. And so that's why, even to this day, that's how I get clips. I literally just play a playlist that I find fun and I happen to get clips on that. Like I play Drop Zone and Domination is the main thing that I play. And there's no Drop Zone on Black Ops 3, so I play Hardcore Dom because I like Hardcore Dom um, because my friends play it, so I play with them. and from playing that I happen to get clips so that's really it there's nothing that got me into it uh, and I don't have any inspirations no, no, nobody has ever inspired me to play in any way at all not from sniping not red gun yeah I mean nothing at all I, I don't aspire to be like anybody or have ever seen somebody and been inspired off of that the next question what was the first game you ever played um, I don't think there's a, a way for me to answer that I don't because I mean I don't know how old you think I am but like games were already a thing by the time I was born so it wasn't like a new thing or something so I probably played a game to the point where I was so young that I don't remember it so there's no way for me to know what was the first game I ever played as a kid I mean like as a small child I probably like you know I probably asked for my mom's phone and there was probably like a snake game on her phone and that's it and that's what I played I don't remember I really don't but I'll tell you the first uh, game I ever played that was Call of Duty was not even mine that was at a friend's house and uh it was a world at war because i remember we tried to play the campaign and we played some online he wanted to play like zombies but i was like fuck that because i was like i don't know i was kind of young but I, and and i didn't know the way zombies worked i thought it was just gonna be like a weird zombies game i didn't know it was like the way zombies is now but yeah that's really it that's what i played uh that was the first cod i played i don't i there's no possible way for me to tell you what game i ever first played but, uh, but yeah, that's really it, guys. Uh, there were, like, two more questions that were left, but I didn't really like those questions. They were kind of uh, dumb and whatever. And so, yeah, thank you guys for leaving me questions, the people that did. And, uh, yeah, thank you for 500 subscribers. Not that it really means anything to me because I still don't get the views. Fuck that. Uh, but thank you guys, though, for the support on uh, Inferno 3. It's got the most likes of any of my other videos. And so I, I do appreciate that. And uh, that's really it. That's all I got to say. Uh, thank you guys for watching and peace.